Well, welcome, as Andy said. Uh, Turtle Hospital, we have a few uh, different goals here that we really try to achieve. Most importantly, we try to teach people how to be responsible uh, in, in terms of um, uh, how it's going to affect wildlife, not only sea turtles, but dolphin, manatee uh, of the sort. So uh, the other big uh, component to what we do here is we, as Andy said, we're the only licensed veterinary hospital in the world solely for sea turtles. And I'm going to take you up there first. We're going to start there. Uh, we'll do just a, a, a brief little walkthrough, and I'll talk about what we do as far as some of the unique procedures that we perform here. Uh, in the enclosure, I have a school group or uh, a, a tour group out here right now. Uh, we see approximately 30 to 40,000 people a year that come through to get an intimate encounter with sea turtles. And Tara's out there right now with one of these groups. So as soon as they pull through, I'm going to introduce you to all our patients. I have uh, 43 sea turtles here right now. And then uh, the, the big excitement for us, and I hope for you guys, is we get to release one here in about an hour, which is our, our big payday. Um, this is why we do everything that we do. We're going to head about a mile, mile and a half towards the seven mile bridge here, and we're going to toss out Kentucky, who's been with us for three months. He's attacked by a shark, actually. He's got a wedge taken out of the side of him. So, so we um, you know, teach people when, when you're out there fishing uh, how much better these the circle hooks are for, for wildlife's sake. You know, for the for the fish sake, but for the wildlife sake too, that could possibly swallow it. And the perfect example is this turtle, who who passed this fish up. And you know, we give him metamucil and vegetable oil and laxative, uh, all the same stuff that we take. But um, you know, we can get that through them with with the right medications. That looks like a long line for a hook. It is. Yeah. No medication. We're getting that through. Not at all. Uh, of course, you just made a mess as soon as you guys all walked up, so we'll go move on to one that has a little bit clearer tank. But uh, Wilma is one of, one of those casualties who uh, uh, got into a fight with a, a tackle box. She's got some big stainless steel hooks in, in her intestines. So. Still? Still. Uh, they've been in there for months, and they, they're not moving through. They're, they're moving. Uh, she's on, on heavy laxatives, and we're getting them to move, but they're not passing. So. This is Kentucky's last day in the tank. Going to get free in the keys. What could be better? That's way a lot. Thank you. Uh -huh. you guys are what do you weigh, like 80 pounds? 53. I mean 153? Yeah, 340 pounds. 150 pounds each girl. Yeah. Oh, my sister. Hey, bye. <laughs> Look at her, she's in shock right now. Now she's going to escape. Forward, 